Hi, I'm Marna, and about a month ago, I don't know, give or take, um, I ordered some things from AliExpress online, and they were on sale, and they're coming in, and I'm very excited about that. Um, so I have my two girls, Birdie and Peaches here, to help me open some things, and I think I know who is in this box, and I'm excited about her. Um, I'm hoping all of this is what I think, but you know how that is. Oh, look, you open the bag and there is more. Nothing wrong with that. Okay, I wanna open this carefully because I think I know what this is. And I'm really tickled it's here. Oh, only one. Okay, you get these little balls and they have texture on them. And I think they're really, really cute. I'm gonna make something for my um, Blythe dolls out of that Well. Oh, okay, let's see. Does it go this way? Okay. Gonna have to have the camera. Oh, wait, there we go. Whoa, crack it open. Oh, yes. All right, you're gonna have to get close up on these. These are Adam's Family and um, Tim Burton's Nightmare Before Christmas earrings. I'm gonna use these for my... Um, Wednesday Adams. I have some Wednesday uh, Wednesday Adams dolls I'm working on. Some will be for sale. And a couple are for gifts. And guess what? A couple for me. Me, me, me. How cute are those? I think my favorite. That you can't hardly see. That's a shame. But it's Wednesday with her um, umbrella. I like uh, Gomez and Morticia here the best. What do you like the best out of these earrings? Uh, the ball's pretty cute too. I am gonna set these like that so we don't knock any on the floor. Now let's hope, oh, this came with it. I gotta count those too. I had bought several of those because um, they are so perfect. And I might buy more. Let's see what we got. Is this, oh, I know what this is. I know what this is. These are cute. I like them. They're just a fun little thing. Fun to wear to doll shows, especially BlytheCon. I got a lot of compliments on my um, necklace during the BlytheCon 2022. It is a um, Blythe doll necklace, and it comes with the chain and everything. They're really cute. Uh, less than, you can find them less than $3, but watch yourself. They used to be cheaper. Now they're also charging as much, if not more, shipping. You really have to watch it now on, um, oh cool, on uh, um, AliExpress because they tell you one price and you put it in your cart and they add shipping and um, sometimes taxes and stuff. It's like, it said free shipping. So when you add items to your cart on AliExpress, watch the, total going up. I got some of these um, plastic bags to put a uh, product in for sale. Um, I'm just looking at the sizes, trying to decide what I want. It's that little fold over cellophane-y feeling um, bags. Okay, look what happened again. I don't know, this is really getting ridiculous. I, I might take them back to the post office here and say, I don't think it's our, this town doing it. I really think it's Kansas City, if you want to know the truth. And I'm going to start watching because I think it's the items coming through Kansas City. It's nothing. Um, that are getting so smashed up and it's just maddening. Okay, this was Darren's idea, and I'm really tickled, and I came up with a name. We were talking about this on the way to the Blythe Con. We would like to travel more, just fun little trips. We would like to see more of the United States. We've lived here all our life. My daughter-in-law is a legal immigrant, and um, she has seen all 50 states. I have not. I'm... I'm 65 years old, born and raised here, and I have not. So we thought that was a really fun idea. This doll, I'm going to give a little face up. 
her hair is back to normal. You know, for a while they were coming, it felt double, but that's what we wanted. And Darren said, get one that looks like chrome. Her name is going to be, now some of you are probably not old enough, or if you're not in the United States, you won't know what I'm talking about. Her name is going to be Ruth 66. And we are gonna travel on the old Route 66, which is now other highways, and visit some places along the way. And she's gonna be sitting in a car seat. And I said to Darren, how would we dress her? And he said, like Fonzie's girlfriend, which I thought, it's a brilliant idea. So at the doll show in Cincinnati, the fashion doll show, this was in, one of the bins and it was like 50 cents and when i saw it i thought we had just been talking about it and i thought oh how cute she'll look like she has on her boyfriend's leather jacket and i hope i don't have to take her hands off to show you this let's put it on real fast ruth 66 is going to be her name and i'm going to shorten the sleeves on this a little bit and i'm trying to figure out how to put the uh, 19, well, way back. Came, became popular in about the 20s, I believe, where you had a cuff on the sleeve. If anybody has an idea of what I could use for those cuffs that they used to have, I'm thinking a sock top. It won't be perfect, but it'd be cute. So this is Ruth 66, and I'm excited to get her face up and get her ready to go on Route 66. Remember when they used to have songs about that in the Chevy commercials? You know, see the USA and the Chevrolet. That's, that's what she's reminiscent of. Thank you for watching the Dolls Rescue Channel. Please leave a like, a comment, and subscribe.